Okay. Second PoE video. And I thought I'd add uh, all my add-ons that I use for PoE that kind of help me make money or just help me with just quality of life. And uh, we just got a couple. So here we go. The first one has to be a PoE stack. PoE stack is, uh, there's another tool called Excellence, if you remember that. But if you're new to it, basically this allows you to get a decent overview. It doesn't count a lot of stuff, right? It can't add unique, um, unique like rares and like really specific stuff that it may be worth divines and it's not going to add that but it's going to add all your regular stuff right so it, you you kind of load up your tabs uh and it shows me all of my tabs that i have and it tells me you know my total divine worth as you can see i bought something <laughs> and uh now i'm down here gotta work up um uh, and it's just it's really nice to know Wait a minute. I had this fucking thing in my inventory. I'm gonna sell that shit. You know what I mean? Like it's just, it's just a nice uh, a, a nice program. So I just kind of select all my tabs, and then it filters from the most value to the least, and I can kind of figure out like, oh, okay, I got seven patients. So I can two divine. I could sell those, you know. And uh, it just it just kind of helps you figure out what's worth selling, and uh, kind of stuff you you can you can sell so poe stack very very good the next one i'm gonna stop at is poe ninja poe.ninja links for all of these will be in the description by the way uh poe ninja is just a really really nice program quality of life like website uh you can check the economy and uh you can see prices on on whatever i don't really use this part of the build i will say Oh my goodness, hold on, sorry. Okay, so I will say that for this program, all I really use is builds. You go over to the builds, you can even add your own character to see how much DPS you're doing. So that's really, really nice. Right now I'm sitting at 20 mil DPS. I, I need some really big upgrades to get any further though, unfortunately. So, um, but you know, we're working towards it. But it's it's really simple, right? If if you have a build, you can say like, okay, I got a mage blood, I, I'm I'm rocket tornado shot, and then I can filter past like the DPS, see what people are rocking. I can pick this guy and kind of get an idea of like what a super, super end game. Like this fucking guy's got a Kalanja ring and and a mage blood and everything else with the double forbidden jewels. Um you know, and, and boom, you, you have you have somebody's build to copy. And this is what I do every league. I have a league starter. I follow maybe I follow a guide. Sometimes I follow a guide, sometimes I don't. Um and I'll get to maps and then I'm coming here. You know, then I'm coming here. I'm seeing like, oh, okay, what the what what's the meta doing? What what's what's fucking what's everybody fucking doing? And I I kind of build out my character and it goes way smoother when I do this and, and kind of like look at people's vids because of it or uh, not vids, but people's builds. And I kind of tweak mine around theirs. And that's how I usually make a lot of money because I progress in a smart way, right? I'm not buying useless shit. So that was PoE.Ninja. The next one is going to be the next two is going to be in game and the main one that most people will know is the price checker where you can press control d and it will give you a price check you can't see this because it's a real specific item but it, it gives a nice little ui overlay it tells you all of your stats like uh, let's say i want to select this this and this and and take that off oh it doesn't have any matches take this off oh shit this oh shit this okay i'll trade that and then i can click the trade button and see like what people are are buying this item for right and i i can kind of like figure out okay this is this this item is worth this much and it's really really helpful in in, in terms of pricing uniques if you don't really know so let's say you have a lot of uniques you can go to your unique tab 
and you know scroll over control d something real quick boom that one's going for an elk we already know uniques are really really easy to price rares on the other hand are a little bit harder to price uh, that's when you you want to select. Okay, what what's what's good about my item? Okay, well I I'm stacking a little bit of dexterity on it. I got a little bit of move speed, but my main thing is increased effect of tailwind, uh, with tailwind of course, and onslaught. Uh, and then I can trade, I can trade these out. Me try to get some matches. Dex movement speed. Yeah, there we go. And then I hit trade, pull up my trade website immediately, and I can see, okay, this is how much this one's going for, right? And I can kind of I can kind of like base what I should price things and do it very very efficiently. So, that was POE Awaken. There's some other stuff uh, about it. There you can press shift space while you're in game and you have access to cheat sheets. So, if you like the whole syndicate garbage dude i i don't like it i'm gonna be honest it's really good though it is really good all right i'm not a hater i just don't like it uh but it tells you where you want the person to be and what kind of rewards you would get uh you can also map roll to make sure and look at your maps on whether or not to just quickly see if they cannot leech life cannot leech mana etc and and stump stuff like that dump sorting quickly type something in and you know you're able to to price check those those kind of things but yeah that's pretty much it and the other main one which i think is the lesser known type which is called poe lurker so this is what this is this is what poe lurker is so in general in in like the general sense somebody's going to let me turn this off this off this off and this off somebody's going to message you and ask, uh, like, hey, I want this item. You'd have to right click them. You'd have to um, invite them to the hideout, wait until they're in their hideout, and then, you know, right click uh, their portrait and then uh, trade them. And then, boom, you're good. Leave the party, kick them, whoever, whatever. Uh, basically, this kind of stops a lot of that uh, and makes it really, really nice. PoE Lurker is, is one of the tools I've used for, for, at least a couple years now it's really nice i like it 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 pops up a little icon on your latest trade you can click it once and it'll invite them to the party you can click this little blue tab right here and that will tell them hey please wait um or you can click the red button and it'll kick them out and when they're here it'll just it'll highlight the color it'll it'll say that your that person has been invited that person is in your hideout. You click it and click that same icon, and it immediately starts a trade. And as soon as that trade is over, it kicks them from the party, and you're you're going about your day. Um, it's an extremely helpful tool. You can also, it's going to be in your system tray. So if I pull this up and go into settings, here we go. Uh, there's a, there's some a few stuff. I don't really mess with the builds, but you can go to the messages and kind of customize your message on what you what you want i don't customize mine but yeah you can make cool little quips so if you ever trade with somebody and it says they have some crazy long line of stay safe exile etc 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 or it labels you by the name um you can do that with these tags by your name you know you know i could put like on my thank you as soon as the trade's over i'll be like yo thanks and then press space and hit buy uh, buy your name and it'll say yo thanks so and so yeah you know something simple like that it's just a really really nice trading tool uh, and it's especially good when there's a lot of people spamming you right so let's say like let's say i want to uh, sell some fossils or i want to sell some what's another one fucking essences right i have a lot of essences and if i were to price all of these out with my awakened trade and start pricing them all out, right? Boom, boom, you know, keep on fucking doing that. Um, I'm going to get spammed. I'm going to get spammed a ton. And you're able to filter through all of that. You don't have to go through your messages. You can just click that icon, wait until they're there. It'll tell you where to, to select your item from the health globe. You can just click it and it immediately highlights the item. Let's say it'll just be like, It'll just be like scarab so-and-so, and then it'll highlight the scarab that you need or something. And anytime that you click 
the little health globe when you have a trade active. We don't have a trade active. Um, but yeah, yeah, so that's PoE Lurker. I'll link everything in the description. There's only four add-ons that I mainly use. And yeah, so that was the video. I hope you like it. It was my second fucking video. For PoE, I'm gonna try to make some more. But um, yeah, so that's what I use. Uh, hopefully it helps you and uh, hopefully you can get some something good out of it and uh, yeah links are in the description all right catch you later